Hi, my name is Chris Hansen. I'm the Technical Director for Seaperch. And I'm Fiona Redmond. And I'm Gwen Gray. And we're here today to walk you through the process of how to build a Seaperch. The first thing you'll want to do is take out the inventory list. If you open up and you're missing anything, get a hold of us at seaperch.org and we can work with you to make sure we get you all the parts you need. So now we are ready to begin our Sea Perch build. So what we'll do is we will clear off the table and bring out the parts that we need to start building our frame. For our first unit of building Sea Perch, we'll be following the manual. So feel free to follow along in your own manual. The first thing we need to do is lay out and cut our sections of PVC pipe. The dimensions for doing those are on page three of the manual, and that page three layout allows you to get the most efficient layout for all of your parts. So the first thing you're going to want to do is grab your tape measure and your marker, and go ahead and measure out each of the distances, and then mark those distances on the pieces of PVC pipe. Later, when we go to pull them all together, we'll be able to tell the six inches from the four inches to the four and a half without having to remeasure them all the time. First one is six and a half, followed by five on the same piece. And we will continue to measure and cut all these parts out. And then when we come back, we'll go through drilling the parts to get them ready as well. So let's just real quick go through all of our cut pieces and make sure we have what we think we're supposed to have. We should have two six and a half inch pieces. You should have two four and a half inch pieces. Yep. Okay. Now take one of those four and a half inch pieces and put it off to the side. We should have two two and a half inch pieces. We should have four five inch pieces. Okay. You want to take two of those and put them off to the side with that four and a half inch. Okay. Two four inch pieces and four one and a half inch pieces. And then we should have a few random pieces that were marked X or scraps. So we'll take those and put them into our sea perch box. We'll hold on to those in case we come up with a creative use for them later. Okay. But for now, we will take them off the tables and get them out of the way. 